You have no friends in this building, John. You're gonna have to bring your own. What you gonna do first? We think I'm gonna do. You're all fired. Beth, you're my new chief of staff. Back to work. Oh, it's gonna get good on Yellowstone. And after waiting almost two years for the rest of season five, uh, fans can finally get their hands on part two of Yellowstone, which returns this Sunday on Paramount+. Plus. Now, the reason I'm here is because Devo uh, headed down to New York City yesterday for the season five part two celebration on the red carpet. Now, that's going to be streaming on Paramount Plus uh, uh, later this month. We'll give you more information about that. It's been almost two years since these two parts, uh, but, uh, but but fans have been waiting around. They've been hanging out, uh, waiting for it, and Devo was on the carpet last night to uh, catch up with all the cast. Take a look. What's up, Canada? It's Devo Brown here in New York City, live on the black carpet for season five, part two, and the series finale of Yellowstone. I got my Canadian tuxedo on so I can kind of fit in with the cast and get all Western with them. We got a chance to talk to the cast to see how this series is going to wrap up. Everyone's forgotten who runs this valley. Time to remind them. Uh, congrats, man. We're getting ready to wrap this thing up. We are, I think so. I don't know. You know it's TV, and so you never know, like I think. <laughs> maybe we are, maybe not, though. I just remember those first days when we got on set and we were trying to build these characters and these relationships, and, and to see how far that's gone now is quite a ride. I don't even know how we got here. Listen, for me, I've done a lot of stuff over the last 35 years. This is one of the special ones, and it's not just the role that I've been able to play, but it's the people I've been able to play with, you know, with Kevin, Kelly, Wes, Luke. This is the last time we're all going to be together like this, you know, last premiere, uh, and we've all wrapped, and so this is it. This is, we got some celebrating to do tonight, man. Your character, I feel like, you know, recently he's more of the grounding kind of role. He's kind of brings everybody down a little bit. He's calmed down in that sense. Have, have you noticed that? You know, there's so much drama, uh, and of course that's what piques a lot of people's interest, and it's entertaining. Um, there's got to be some level of uh, level-headedness, I think. I think culture has kind of taught rainwater and, and all the indigenous people of being this genuine and sincere about what the intention is and their efforts and how purposeful it is, you know, a purpose of life. I think everyone's grown in, in, in their different ways. Uh, the one thing that has stayed the same and is the backbone of, of my storyline is Monica and Casey's love for each other, their desire to just have a simple life and a family, uh, and that desire constantly being obstructed by the Dutton family drama. You know, we've made jokes with Taylor, like, can we ever just be happy, man? Like, can you give us like one season where we're just having a good time? And clearly there's no drama in that. That's not fun to watch, but. Do your friends even say to you, man, that's couple goals. Like we want our relationships to be like that. I know, right? Through thick and thin, ride or die. All they want is, you know, they just want to be together with, with Tate, that's it. So hopefully they'll get some peace. We see the characters of Beth and Rip. What is it about Beth that Rip has such a soft spot for? Because she literally can do whatever she wants and, and go wild. And he's like, that's cool, man. Yeah, I mean, listen, I, I quit taking her serious a long time ago. <laughs> I never really took her that serious. And I laughed at her, you know? And I think that endeared her to me. How would you describe how the fans are gonna feel when it's done? Oh man, I, I hope they love it. I hope they, you know, it's it's only six episodes. So I hope that they just enjoy the ride and and forgive us for making them wait so long. <laughs> yeah, great stuff right there, Devo. Yellowstone season five, part two, streams on Paramount Plus this Sunday, this weekend, uh, November 10th. And may I add, uh, Devo looked good in that Canadian tuxedo as well, right? Uh, as we go to break this morning, Cheryl Hickey sits down for an exclusive chat with Shania Twain. I hear Cheryl. Is that Cheryl there? There's Sh I Look at that beautiful yellow top. She's running into the shot. Uh, We're going to do it soon. <laughs> We're going to do it soon. Uh, as uh, Shania, as you know, doing is, great. is joining Canada's Got Talent as a new judge and why she celebrates every little moment every little in moment. life. Here's a sneak peek, and here's Cheryl Hickey. 